Dude, the community center is a perfect place to learn the basics. To do a low ollie, move the right stick directly down and then flick it straight up. To do a big ollie, hold the right stick down until your knees are fully bent and then flick it straight up. If you hold the right stick down just like an ollie, then flick it off to the right, you'll do a kick flip or a heel flip, depending on your stance. To do a shove it, hold the right stick down, then move it around to the right. Those are the basics, dude. Now let me see you try it. Brad, that was pretty fresh. Now try a really high one. All right, here's a new one. Yo, that was a banging heel flip right there. All right, now let's try a simple shove it. That's what I'm talking about. Yo, it's time to step it up. Just so you know, harder tricks are just combinations of kit flips, shove and ollies. Now you can ollie, but to skate obstacles, you gotta learn timing. Do a small push, tap the X button. You hold it down a little bit longer, you're gonna take a harder push. All you need is three good pushes and you're up to speed. You can use the square button to push with your left foot and the X button to push with your right foot. Make sure you get a good approach when ollieing up a curb. Give yourself enough speed and distance and you'll have no problem. When ollieing onto something bigger, make sure you give yourself more speed and more distance. You'll figure it out eventually. Timing just takes practice. Let's just cruise around the parking lot. It only takes about three strong pushes to reach top speed. And you know what? Break when you need to. If you want to try to ollie up on those two platforms over there, you got to time your ollies right. Yo, that was some good work right there. If you don't get your timing down, you're going to get worked. In this game, timing is everything. Now you learned how to ollie into the air. Now let's teach you a couple of options while you're up there. When using tranny to get air, prepare your ollie early and wait for your front wheels to get to the top before you pop. When you're in the air, use the left stick to spin your body. Make sure you get your board straight before you hit the ground. Pull the R2 button or the L2 button to grab with your left or your right hand. To do a tweak, push the right stick in any direction while you're grabbing the board. You want to make sure you let go of the tweak before landing. That's all there is to it. Now get out there and let them rip. All right, let's go ollie off some of these trainees now. Remember ah, your timing. It's not happening. Damn, that was huge. Okay, let's see you grab that board. Yeah, you got it. That left stick is going to spin you around while you're in the air. Let's go try some of those. What, what, what? All right. Let's try to do some air, grab your board, tweak it out, and get some mad style, yo. Yo, that was buttery, dude. Look at you, you fancy little freak. I think you're ready for some grinds now. Getting on a rail is all about a good approach. So line yourself up right and time your ollie perfectly. When you're in the air, you use the right stick to adjust your board. The way your board hits the rail determines what trick you're gonna do while you're on it. To adjust your body back into position, you use the left stick when you're coming off the rail. All right, dude, now it's up to you to go try it. Grinding a rail ain't that hard. Just time your ollie right and land on the rail. work, man. Yo, that was, yo, I'm psyched to see that you're out here and you're ready to do this. I tell you what, I'll film you for a little while. Let's see what you got. Okay, camera is on. Check the footy on that. You know what's really sick about this game? 
You can go to the pause menu, select replay, and then you can mess with the footage any way you want. You can go forward, you can go backwards, you can even change the camera angle. Yo, it's pretty sick. Dude, I hope you're psyched, because that one was dope. All right, let me explain to you about the mini-map. See that dot in the middle of it? That's you. You see all those other little icons around it? That's all different stuff that's right in that area. Could be pros, could be challenges, could be what ads. So skate over to it, see what it is. This map, it is definitely useful. Hey man, what's up? Jumps like you, I gotta keep them in line, so prepare to... Okay, so you got your ollie, the foundation of all tricks. You know, push it back, flick it forward, you pop it. So this time, try flicking it forward first, then pushing it back quickly, and you'll do an ollie. An ollie is just like an ollie, except you're doing it off your nose. Any trick you can ollie with, you can nollie with, thus doubling your bag of tricks. To do an ollie flip trick, you want to move the right stick up, and then you flick it down to the left or the right. It all depends on your stance and how you're moving the stick around. All right, enough with this tech talk. Let's go try something. Hey, let's take a tour around the park, but you can only do nollies. Yo, Shingo! Hey, what's up? Yo, we got a new player in town, man. Look, I can see it on the tip of your tongue. Go ahead, ask. Go ahead, ask. You wanna play a game of skate? Okay, that didn't even hurt. That one was perfect. Oh, that hurt. Wow. It's like I'm playing against PJ Ladd. Does it look like it hurts? You're making it tough for me. How was that one? You 
might have me on that one. Oh, I wish I give me a two little lead next time. get some photos in a mag. You should try and hook up with Seth. He shoots photos for the skateboard mag. I'm pretty sure he's shooting down at the elementary school. Oh, cool, you beat Shingo. Yo, check it out, man. Today is your lucky day. How's it going? Manuals are a big part of skateboarding. If you haven't figured it out yet, manual by pushing slightly back on the right stick. Find that perfect little spot, and then you hold it there. Just remember, be gentle with it, and you'll find that balance point. Same thing with the nose manual. You just push forward. It's just like a manual, but you want to push up on the right stick. To land in manual, you want to make sure you're in that balance point before you land. Try flicking the stick to trick out. To flip out of a manual, you have to flick the right stick from the balance point. Check this out. I'm going to flip in manual and flip out. Yeah, man! I told you you could do it! Hey dude, I'm Seb. I shoot for the skateboard mag. You think you can do better than these clowns? And I hope so, because I've been was full. So solid, dude. Let's go. Yo, it's your photo. Pick one. If you ain't feeling it, you could always do the challenge again. That just happened. 
Yo, I'm pretty sure that Sam hooked those photos up nice. But, um, we should also get busy filming, man. You don't got enough footy, basically, that just didn't happen. Once you get enough footy, then you can get sponsored. Once you get sponsored, then you can get paid. The hell you think I'm doing here? Hey, you want to come up? We need to film. Doing single tricks are sick, but I think you're gonna want to show people you can skate. Do a line real quick. It should be fun. Lines and skateboarding is all about consecutive tricks without spending too much time cruising from trick to trick. Sketchy landings and sloppy tricks, that's just gonna cut your line time short. Try to keep them as clean as possible. That's all you really need to know about lines, so just make sure you mix up your tricks, keep it creative, and flow them. See how much board control you have. You know how to grind, you know how to do tricks. So why don't you put the two together and see what kind of technical skating you come out with. You can do any flip trick you want into a grind, but just make sure you time it so you land on the rail. To flip out of a grind, you just use the right stick. You can do all sorts of grinds and slides. You just have to make sure you adjust your board in the air with the right stick. You can always check your backpack for a variety of different grinds. But for now, let's find a rail, flip in, grind it, and flip out. Yo, you put that into the streets, you're gonna be money. You're gonna replay this, you're gonna be psyched. Yo, you had some good ass board control right there. That's the way to do it. Hey, it's Shingo. I'm gonna go check out the best trick contest. You should enter. Yeah, I told my mom I'm gonna go to the library and study. <laughs> she believed me. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, I'll see you there. Bye. Yeah, hey there, my name's Guz. I'm gonna be emceeing the contest. All right, round one of this best trick contest is on the big blue boom out in the center there. See how big you can go, boost some airs, and just make sure you don't hit anybody else. Have fun. Music makes skating better. Start skating when you hear it. I couldn't miss that one. Two, if you want to score big, get up onto these mani pads, throw down a manual, possibly a grind, see what you can do across that gap, land that as a sequence, and you're scoring big. Are you ready? It's go time! Do this! Another word for next round because I need one. Okay, here's the final round the capper. 
Handrail galore, and we got ledges on either side. Use the taco for a rebound and have fun. pretty much learn how to pump or you can't skate transition but once you get it down you'll be launching huge airs before you know it to prepare for a pump you want to push up on the left stick as you approach a transition once you hit the transition you want to release the left stick and stand up pumping is a huge part of riding bowls and half pipes but you can also pump to get big air on any curved surface if you need to get a little bit of extra speed on the streets, try pumping some tranny. It's definitely going to help. To do a Christ air, do a basic grab and then hold the circle button. All right, now it's your turn to try. Saw your photo on the skateboard, Mac. Yeah, that's a sick photo. Hey, this is Eric. He rides for the shop. What's up? Hey, we're having a little demo later today. It's our annual Jubba Jubba Jingle Jam to commemorate the... Hey, what does that commemorate again? I don't know. The last time you landed a kickflip? Ouch. Yeah. Well, if you want to skate in it, come and check it out. Oh, hey, there's some shop t-shirts over there. You can grab one if you want. 